my, my thing is, I'm going to be honest. I don't agree with certain beliefs, but like you said, Donald Trump used to be your friend, right? Mm -hmm. um, we're taught to love one another in spite of our beliefs, but a lot of times we crucify. I honestly think that Kanye is a lot smarter than we think because him and his wife have gotten people free from prison. I think that you get in close as you can to make things happen. I also think that I hate to say it like this, but the urban community in a lot of ways isn't quick to forgive. I think social media has taken the grace out of a lot of things. So if you make a mistake, now luckily I came out with a time there wasn't a lot of camera phones and it was just like Black Planet or something. So <laughs> stupid stuff that I did, you'll never know about. There is no footage. Yeah. But now people do and say things and now it's forever. It's imprinted and it becomes a part of who they are. When you say Michael Vick, you don't talk about the rehabilitation and the things he does to help kids in schools. You say convicted dog fighter. It's mm -hmm. like we always want to keep the negative connotation attached to somebody. But most of the time, it's to somebody that's black. Because if, if, in, the, in the pop community, if you didn't rape a woman, kill a dog, uh, you could probably rob a bank. But if you come back, they love a good comeback story. Mm -hmm. So to be honest, even with music, um, you look at the Stones, you look at Cher, they can go do Vegas. And Raheem, you know this, the OJs are on the Chitlin circuit. And, and a lot of these groups that really made music, my cousin is Philip Bailey from Earth, Wind & Fire. Mm -hmm. Luckily, they're doing stadiums, but a lot of these other groups that really influence these pop acts are doing the Chitlin circuit while these pop acts are doing arenas and Wembley and all these different things. That's because they get the support. So even though I don't agree with Kanye's political beliefs, if that's what it really is, mm -hmm. I agree with what he's doing. He is secretly helping the black community by getting helping with his wife, getting these prisoners out. So uh, of course I'd never vote for Donald Trump. He can say he did. He put on the hat. Now that took it a little too far, but <laughs> truthfully, um, even if some of you viewers out here, if you voted for Donald Trump, I still love you. I don't agree with you, but that's what we keep trying to preach. You know, let's bipartisanship and let's come together and, and discuss things. And, and even if we don't agree, let's come to an accord. A lot of times it's not that because if somebody doesn't agree with you, then it becomes hostile. And that's what's why. I think we should, we, we got to stop tuning people out just because we disagree with them. We should ask them why, why you think that way. Now, I, I give the credit more to Kim Kardashian because I feel like she's been in the front forefront as, as far as like helping people get out of prison when it comes to Donald Trump on the backs of some black women that have been working on it for a long agreed, time. Agreed, agreed, like, agreed. You know what I mean? Like we gotta, we, they, they are quick to be forgotten, but I do appreciate, Kim doesn't have to do any of that. She's set for life. And I do love that she gets involved and uses her influence. I got, I got another theory though. And okay. This, this, uh, this is something I've been debating about for the last... 12 months, maybe 15 now since they've been active, whatever. Was okay. what really Kanye is setting himself up to do? And people think that I see politics. the politics. Kanye, Kanye is moving like a politician. <laughs> <laughs> and don't be surprised when he actually does attempt to run for president. Oh my god. And 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 and, and, and I'm not gonna and I'm not saying that whether or not they got my vote or not. I want to know right now on uh, Fox Soul, Raheem, would you vote for Kanye? But, 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 what I, but what I will tell you is... Free Yeezys for life! <laughs> <laughs> well, we, but, and it, it, what I will tell you is, is that, I mean, it's kind of been proven like this point. If Ronald, if Ronald Reagan can become president, if Donald Trump can become president, I think it's fair to say that the argument that anybody can become can president. Become president. The bar is really low. And I don't know. And I don't know what that, and I don't know how, how, how great of a thing that is. But, 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 <laughs> but, but really Rob, which, which, which guy is he? Is he the guy that stood up during Katrina to George Bush? Or is he the guy that's MAGA? Because I, mean, I honestly moving, feel like this is just like, a play. He's moving like you a know, He's moving right. like a He's moving I like a right. <laughs> You know, and, 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 and just to, um, it was day. I just saw a recent interview with Damon Dash. And what's the what's the cat that he interviews a lot of the rappers and him and Dame was going back. I know you're talking about Vlad. But, but it speaks to this also the fact that we just spent ten minutes discussing him. Yeah, that's what he wants. That's that's he's he's done enough of his 
Uh, <laughs> and he made it where it's almost he's the only thing on the menu to talk about. Like that, we, that, you know, I'm so, talking to two R and B stars right now, and we're talking about Donald Trump. Oh, so, so you know what I mean? So, uh, and we talk about Kanye West. So that, so that, so that kind of tells you like the mindset of psyche.